ceramic capacitors are the most important type of capacitor that we use today in electronic circuits. They're used in their billions each year. Uh, these capacitors come in a variety of sizes and formats and all, all sorts of things. So what we're going to do in this video is tell you all about ceramic capacitors, all the information you need to know. We'll tell you about their characteristics, the physical or mechanical um, formats for them. We'll tell you where they're used in circuits and a host of other useful information. So keep watching and we'll tell you all this information. As the name indicates, these capacitors use ceramic as the dielectric. But as there are several types of ceramic that can be used, this means that they can meet a wide variety of requirements. Let's look at their overall characteristics. First of all, ceramic capacitors are not polarised like electrolytic capacitors, and this means that they can be orientated either way round in a circuit. It doesn't matter. Their values range from just a few picofarads right up to about 0.1 microfarads and sometimes even more. They're also available in a wide variety of working voltages, from just a few volts for some transistor designs up to a kilovolt and even more, where high voltages are to be used. Ceramic capacitors are also widely used for high frequencies, RF frequencies, often up into the microwave region, which makes them ideal for use in many modern wireless circuit applications and general RF designs. The wide variety of different ceramics available means that the type or variant of the ceramic dielectric is important when choosing one of these capacitors. Some provide high stability, others tight tolerance, and others provide high volumetric capacitance and so forth, but that's a topic for another video. We're now going to look at the various formats for these capacitors. Although there are several formats for them, the two main types by far are the leaded disc ceramic and the multi-layer ceramic capacitor, or MLCC. Let's look at the disc ceramic capacitor first. As the name implies, the capacitor is based around a disc of ceramic, and either side of this there are the capacitor plates. The leads are then bonded on and the overall capacitor coated to ensure that it's protected mechanically as well as from moisture and other contaminant ingress. Disc ceramic capacitors are available in a wide range of values as we mentioned before. Now let's take a look at MLCC capacitors. These are available as leaded types but also they're used in vast quantities as surface mount components. MLCC stands for Multi-Layer Ceramic Capacitor, and as the name implies, these capacitors use multiple layers to achieve the levels of capacitance needed within a small volume. Remember that capacitance is dependent upon a variety of factors, including the area of the plates. Using multiple layers within the capacitor, it's possible to significantly increase the level of capacitance to achieve the levels needed within a very small volume. This is a very important factor for surface mount capacitors, which need to be very small. It's worth noting that for surface mount capacitors, there are connections on either end of the component, and these are soldered directly onto the board. These capacitors are intended for use with automated means of production, and they're often supplied in reels like this one, or some are fed loose into a hopper on the placement machine. Ceramic capacitors find many uses in circuits. They are widely used as coupling capacitors between stages of analog designs. They're used for decoupling, particularly for removing high frequencies and transients as a result of their value range and their high frequency performance. However, they aren't used for smoothing because the capacitance levels aren't high enough. But they are used in many RF circuits, especially the surface mount ones, as they offer very low values of unwanted inductance. Also, the high tolerance ones are used in many filter and oscillator circuits and, and the like. Although ceramic capacitors exist in other formats, the leaded disc ceramic and the surface mount MLCC are by far the most widely used. For more information about these and other types of ceramic capacitor, please check out the description area for links to our website. And also, we'd be really pleased if you would like the video and subscribe to our channel. Thank you.